name is Dylan Horvath. I run um, a company called Cortex Design to design a reader for a lateral flow assay. Good morning and a warm welcome to the brilliant minds gathered here today. To our future engineers, you're not just participants. You're creators, problem solvers, and dreamers. Today, your designs will not only showcase your skills, but also represent the possibilities to see a better world. This isn't just a competition. It's a chance to shine, learn, inspire. So let your creativity flow, your ideas soar, and may your designs leave an impact that lasts far beyond this moment. Have some fun and create something. Woo! So my role here today is uh, judging the, the Cortex Design Challenge. It's to do a, a device reader for a medical diagnostic system. My experience at the MDL Challenge here has been amazing, actually. It's extremely well organized. Students seem really motivated. What we've seen so far is actually a really high level of thought and um, consideration and uh, time that's gone into the challenges so far. Hi, my name is Evan uh, with Unified Engineering. This is uh, my boss, Ed. I'm working for you, though, Evan, sometimes. I'm Ed Vecchi, Vice President of Unified Engineering. It's always good to give back to uh, universities and to see what upcoming talent is. And even though we're acting as mentors, sort of, there's also a reverse mentorship component where we're learning as well. One of the biggest things is doing competitions like this and getting involved with the extracurriculars, we see a huge difference in uh, talent between people who are just doing school and only doing their courses versus those who get out there and get involved with all the activities going on around campus. It's important to uh, support students that are looking to get into CAD design because it's going to be a, a big part of our upcoming society in that if you need something made, it, you can make it yourself and you can take production into a home environment setting. They're, uh, they're pretty constrained on time, 24 hours is, is quite a short amount of time and, yeah. and we're seeing some groups are actually competing, completing all the tasks pretty well um, and that just shows that the project you know, management and the, t and the team are able to work together in, in such a constrained time so that's something that I look for. I thought the whole experience of sitting down and uh, having just a, a team that you're going to work with for the next 24 hours was pretty cool. So that was a new experience, but it was also very, uh, uh, very insightful and a lot to learn from it because you learn more about the design process and uh, how to use your time effectively to create a solution. Even if you weren't participating in the other smaller events like the Smash Bros tournament, like there's other people doing things and it was kind of interesting to see that was going on all throughout the night too. I just want to add the tacos were like really, really good. So <laughs> well done, guys. I really enjoyed the tacos. Feeling too many emotions right now. Um, I'm excited because this is my first designathon and the first one I'm winning. So it's like a huge win for me. Like I've joined a bunch of competitions, but this is definitely the one that I've had the most fun at. And like consistently throughout the whole competition, I was like hyped. Overall, I, I liked the problem because it was addressing needs of people that you know, we're, we're in pain and we were able to use our knowledge and skills to solve that problem. And definitely we'll be coming back next year. 
We stayed up until like 3 a.m. last night catting, and I don't think I've learned more than I did in that one day rather than over the entire semester. Like, I feel so much more confident now after like creating this whole thing in such a short amount of time. Another another day. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. Another day, another dub. You know how it is. <laughs> nah, we're super happy though. We're grateful. Yeah, very grateful. We're grateful for the MDL. We gotta be a two-time champions next year. Be ready for us. Watch out for the Fierce Five. Four. <laughs> Nine. Nine. Six. all of you for coming to this event and making our 8th annual design thon a hit. We hope you were able to learn something or meet someone new this weekend. We hope to see all of you return in 2025 for another crazy jam-packed event with some of the brightest minds in Ontario. This has been MDL, signing off. <laughs>